This guy got boss. Too much boss. Too much boss. Yo, what's up? It's your boy Card No Boy in the black cap. And if you know the rule now, be you already know. <laughs> oh Charlie. I can see that people are still watching the video. I like I, I like the people watching the video, but please subscribe. Please click the red button and subscribe. Hit the notification button. That's the bell. So that when I release any video, you get it ASAP. You bob. It's behind the bars. Yo, make you line up African rappers for me Like a picture, let me make this thing snappy Damn Make you line up African rappers for me Like a picture, let me make this thing snappy So when you're taking a picture, you're snapping a picture That's another way to say it So when you're also being snappy means that you want to be fast, you get it So line up African rappers for him like a picture as he's making the snappy or at the same time he's also coming to kill them snappy meaning that he's come to like destroy them with the bars snappy you get it as fast as possible because none of them can match up to him that's what he's saying huh. i know they ain't open to me but tell me who be close to me most of these rappers will never shine down my chain i wouldn't feel you even if you wear my pain most of these rappers will never shine down my chain. You know chain shine. I will never feel you even if you were my pain. So you can't shine down his chain. Like you can't even shine down his chain talk of him. That's what he's trying to say. Even if you were his pain, you never feel you. Meaning that even your lyrics, then your punchlines, you know they feel you. You are not deep like he is. Like that, he is. That's what he's saying. Not me. That's what Lyrical Joe is saying. You bab. You're not deep like him. So he'll never feel you even if you wear his pain. And you feel pains. And he's saying that he won't feel you. Not me. Let's continue. What's poppin' hey that I told you I'll make it rain. Even if my hustle be blood, it will never be in vain. <sighs> even if my hustle be blood, it will never be in vain. When they say something is in vain, meaning that let's say you they say you told in vain. When you told in vain, meaning that you told or you hustled but you never made anything. It's like cost 90. You are <clears throat> when you take your calculator and press cost. In case you, you, you didn't take your math class serious, take a calculator, press cost. I know some of you don't even know where cost is. Then 90, <laughs> you get zero. So when they say you told in vain, meaning that I was you told and didn't make anything. So he's saying that even if his hustle was blood, it will never be in vain. So he's still going to make it, he's still going to succeed. You bab. And the same time, you can compare it to blood which is in your veins. Who born this guy? What's your reason for the hatred? We don't even give a shit. Too much bread, we constipate that being. What's your reason for the hatred? We don't even give a shit. Too much bread, we constipated. When we say bread in, I don't know, in your country, but in my country, when we say we're making bread after hustle, meaning that we're making the money after hustle, you get it. So too much, we don't, he doesn't even give a shit about whatever you say about him or whatever you're doing. Like, when, when you constipated, you can't give a shit. You can't take a shit. You get it. So he's not even giving a shit because he he's, he has too much bread. He's eating too much bread, too much blood, too much money. So he can't give a shit. I hope you get it. Like, I hope you get what... If you don't get it, kindly comment. I'm going to explain it further. But I think this this explanation, give a shit, bread. When he eats bread, you get constipated. You can't take a shit. And he has too much bread, so he doesn't give a shit. Thinking about bundles of money ever since I was a student. Boy, you go fi ask my teacher, he'll tell you I'm blockheaded. Okay, been thinking about bundles of money ever since I was a student. You can ask my teacher, he'll tell you I'm blockheaded. I'm block. <laughs> the guy in me is coming. I'm sorry. I'm blockheaded. You get it. So, what he's trying to say is when they say someone is blockheaded, that means the person doesn't know anything. And it's a teacher who tells someone that he's blockheaded because. You you get to know that when you go to school and they tell you that do this math or do this spelling that you can't get in Ghana, Charlie, then tell we sir with tire safe. You bab. Yeah, so <laughs> he's saying that. And the same time when you say blocks, we talk when we're talking about bundles of money, meaning that you have bundles of money, it forms a block. You get it. That means you have a, like a lot of money. So he's always thinking about bundles of money. 
and he's block headed meaning that he has blocks on his mind which is the bundles of money on his mind that is what's in his head it's not and see the comparison ask his teacher tell he's block headed so even like right from infancy he's been thinking about the bundles of money so he's been block headed Check! Yeah, you compare Ghana rappers to me, I'm a beast. Them be food with no digest yet, they ain't close to being shit. Don't compare Ghana rappers to him, he's a beast. Their food ain't, that ain't digest yet, they ain't close to being shit. When food doesn't digest, it doesn't become feces, you get it? So it, does, it hasn't come out yet. So it needs to digest. So meaning that Ghana rappers are still, like, they're still in the process of, like, when, once food digests, that means it's, it's done with the process, you get it? Then it comes out as feces, it's done. It's, it has release all the nutrients in it you get it but he's saying that Ghana rappers are not on that level yet so don't compare them to him he's a beast that's what he's saying not me this is a lyrical pistol pistol piece to you whenever we meet this be bars fuck your drop drop flow i know be your mate this be bars fuck your drop drop flow i know be your mate i don't know where you're watching from but when we say bass you know what the bass is um bass is quite luxurious when you're traveling with it um unlike um commercial vehicles like um, the smaller buses that a lot of people sit inside that the mate takes money you get to the conductor takes money he's trying to say that this is bus like bigger bus fuck your truck truck flow which is the commercial vehicle that's quite cheaper than the bus which is a little bit luxurious so he's not your mate he's not your conductor so fuck your truck truck flow the same way you can relate the mate to when you say mate someone and someone are co-equals you get it he's not your mate in this rap game so don't compare yourself to him that's what he's trying to say yeah charlie better hide your girl from me yeah tell him she be your light and i'll be ecg i go take him tell her the first time i didn't get the feelings right so she should expect my second coming jesus christ <laughs> okay so he's saying that hide your girl from him he's ecg he go take him <laughs> <laughs> okay so ecg is the company that controls electricity in ghana and this track was from 2017 back in those days we used to have like problem with um our, our power supply where they can take off the light anytime in 2020 it's the case is different i don't remember the last time i got light off ecg is doing very well so he's saying that ecg can take your light anytime they want because they control it so hide your girl from him he can take your girl from you anytime he wants like ecg that's a comparison and tell your girl that he didn't get the feelings right the first time but she should expect a second coming jesus christ and the bible says that jesus christ is coming again that's the second coming and he's comparing it to that huh, charlie this guy got bars too much bars too much bars i'm still harder i'm still smarter i still smoke y'all yeah. it's a name it's a real money you can name any rapper real talk when i'm on stage they feel me so no shame i mean only my girl can boo me <laughs> real talk when i'm on stage they feel me so only my girl can boo me you see when you're on stage and you're not doing well people go like boo 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 <laughs> And he's comp and the same way only his girl can boo him. That's you know girls call their like their uh, boyfriends boo boo hey boo boo hey boo boo. <laughs> Don't worry. Yeah. So on stage he's so good that he never gets boo on stage, but only his girl can boo him. <sighs> I'm on a chronic, I'm supersonic, I speed and vomit. Make sure the beat is across so I can nail a verse on it. Make sure the beat is across so I can nail a verse on it. You know Jesus Christ was nailed on the cross. He gets it nailed on the cross. So make sure the beat is across so you can nail this verse on it. They didn't care when I started back in the days. I've been an outcast. You can ask Andre. Okay, he's been an outcast. You can ask Andre. I don't know if you remember Outcast, that group, that um, was it American group? Yeah, uh, Andre three, Andre three. God damn it. Andre 3000, 3000, 3000. Yeah, so it's like he's been an outcast. If you say someone is an outcast, that means the person is out. Like, Yapuno. I don't know if you understand, you understand the tree. Yapuno. If you don't understand the tree, outcast, take your dictionary and check it. That who an outcast is. Yapu. That is. <laughs> Yeah, you, you they don't want you in the in, in, in that area. You get it? They don't want you in that area. It's been an outcast. 
you can ask Andre, and he's comparing it to the outcast group in America, Andre 3000. You can go and ask Andre that he has been the outcast. You call for war, I'll pick up and never miss the call. You call for feature, you better be ready and sure. Cause I'll be at this, I'll draw my gun, that be out of war. You call for feature, you better be ready. Cause I'll be at this, I'll draw my gun, that be out of war. So what he's saying is, when you're calling for a feature as a rapper, make sure that you have your bars ready because he's coming to kill. And you draw his gun. And when someone draws a gun, to point at you that means that the person is raising war at you you get it the same way you can say that he will draw his gun that is he will take a pencil or a paint and draw the gun that is art of war when you draw something that's art right that be art of war or when you draw the gun that be art of war lyrical joe <laughs> lj you still a bone, you don't want me to hit up my dog fans. I never they fear lyrical nation day. I get so many supporters, never going anti pay. Okay, okay. You are still a bone. Don't let me hit up my dogs. You are like you saying rapper other rappers. Other rappers are bones, you get it. When he hits up his dogs, which are the goons, his goons, you get it, or his mob or whatever it is, they're going to destroy you. You get it. So he has too much supporters, he's never going anti pay. Anti pay in Ghana means that you wearing trousers or shorts or whatever it is without wearing anything be under it. That's briefs or boxes or whatever it is. We call it supporter in Ghana. <laughs> so he has too many supporters. He never goes anti pay because he has everything, something holding him down. Always, always. Gala Trevor, keep it mute. We hear the talking from the haters. Though we know they sell news, we always show up with the papers. Okay, though we know they sell news, but we we turn up with the papers. So they sell they, they sell the news, but we turn up. You can either um um, um compare it to um that's money papers. We turn up with the papers. They are selling the news, all right. But at the end of the day, we get paid. That's what he's trying to say. And the same way you can say that newspaper. You can when you combine it, newspaper. We turn up with the papers, even though they have the news. We give them the papers to print the news on. Lyrical Joe, Lyrical. There's nothing you think of that I'm never doing, huh? Punches, I'm always in the ring like a loyal married man. Oh, God. <laughs> what kind of analysis is this? See, every line I have to stop it. Punches, always in the ring like a loyal married man. So when you're in the ring, you're coming to fight like it's a boxing fight. You get it. So punches, he always has punches. He's always in the ring. Like a loyal married man. When you take that one too, what do married people wear? Ring. So he always in the ring. He always in the ring. The ring is always on him. Like a loyal married man. A loyal married man who always has his ring on. At the same time, he has the punches. He's always in the ring. Like a boxer. And at the same time, a loyal married man. <laughs> hey God. Them say it be me, they hold the area code, they love my jam. All these ladies, they want screw me, they don't know how tight I am. You see? Okay, so the ladies want to screw him like a screwdriver, like screwdriver. And when you're screwing something, when and it's tight, it's quite difficult. You get it? The ladies want to screw him. The same way when you see someone wants to screw you, basically the person wants to destroy you, you get it? But it's so tight that, forget it, you can't screw him. You can't screw him. The same way when you say someone wants to screw you, meaning that, the person wants to screw you. Screw. <laughs> I don't want to go dirty. The person wants to chop you. <laughs> but it's so tight. But wait, I'm I'm kind of thinking something. I don't I don't like I I don't make that line doesn't make sense to me. Cause if you're so tight, why? If the lady was why? What is the lady going to screw? Is the lady going to? <laughs> Is it gay? <laughs> Sorry, I'm just asking. I'm just asking. Because if the lady is going to wear a strap on and screw you, it makes sense. Because you are tight. That's what you're saying. But if you are tight <laughs> and the lady wants to screw you, where the lady you are going to screw the lady, so she will be tight. I, I I'm not making sense. I know I'm making sense. Behind bars, we analyze the thing. If it's, it doesn't make sense, we'll tell you. It doesn't make sense, even though it's a good line. When it comes to screw, like a screwdriver, that one makes sense. Because when you're screwing something that's tight, it's difficult. No two ways about it. You get it. At the same time, when it comes to screw as in 
destroy someone he's quite he's tight so he has people he has a lot of supporters forget about it. it's not going to work but for the other screw it doesn't make sense in my neck be all shiny, that be swag, try and see. I rock stones in the club, catch me at the VIP. Boy, if they say I'm okay, I rock stones in the club, catch me in the VIP. Reggie Rock Stone, Reggie Rock Stone is a member of the VIP. You get it? So he rocks stones in the club, catch him in the VIP. He's a member of Reg. We have someone we call Reggie Rock Stone, that's a grandpapa of hip hop or hip life, or however you want to put it. Rap, you get it? It's debatable, people debate it all the time. But to some of us, Charlie, it doesn't really matter. He brought it. Keep it like that. It doesn't matter. And he's always in the club. Reggie Rockstar has a club. Yeah. He's always in the club. He's always rocking stones in the club. That if you say ro someone is rocking stones, stones are also diamonds. You get it? Diamonds. So he's always rocking stones in the club. You, you, can, you can catch him in the VIP, which is Reggie Rockstone is also a member of the VIP. Oh, nigga. God boss. Not making waves, then they are not on the sea. Call me. They are not making waves then they are not on the sea on the sea you see waves so if you're not making waves that is you're not hot enough you're not on the sea you're not on the tide you're not riding the waves you're not Charlie you be nobody that's what he's trying to say me there a bulky rapper never running out of beef <laughs> who is aboki aboki sells meat <laughs> Aboki there, so he's, he's the Aboki rapper, he never runs out of beef, he's all, he, he, see, he is the beef, that's the reason why when Cardinero came and Jovi came, he will beef, <laughs> he is the beef, <laughs> he's the Aboki rapper. <laughs> What I be the boss, I'm feeling it, cast not moderate, bringing it to the devil, you guys gonna celebrate, how about celebrate, we don't tolerate, kill them in business, I'm in a suit, that's gonna parade, I come make another lyrical impression, man, you know we run up on everything, everybody know what do we daily, can I grab a never back in a fucking and fucking body, give you no video, you know what's up, nobody need a decision, woo, where did they say, I throw it up, boy, catch a bouquet, take me to Niger, I go speak to air my ghost, brim, say chinnik and me, where did they, I throw it up, guy, catch a bouquet, when I go to Niger, I spit for air my ghost, say chinnik and me, so what is trying to say, you throw the bouquet, when they throw bouquets, you catch it, you get it. So he when he throws the bouquet, he's throwing the lines. Like he has thrown the he has thrown the the rap, whatever, you get it. Catch it so that you also be good. But when he goes to Nigeria, you spit for MI. MI we know MI is one of the best rappers in Africa. We know MI is one of the best rappers in Nigeria. I don't I don't know if I can say he's the best in Nigeria, but I can to me he's the best in Nigeria. You get it. But you spit for MI to say chineke me. Chineke me <laughs> Forgive me, I'm just entertaining you, but <laughs> as I'm entertaining you, remember you guys subscribe. Cause over here, see, don't you don't you like this analysis? Tell me. You tell me. Just comment. If you don't like it, tell me. Aren't we telling you the details? Hey, homie, I'm nasty. Hope you see. See the way I'm Homie, I'm nasty. Hope you see. Nasty C. In South Africa, I'm nasty. Hope you see nasty. See, make them ghost Casper, knock them out. LJ, aka KO, SC rappers, <laughs> you know, aka. So he knocks them out, aka, 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 KO. So you know, KO is like knockout. So aka, aka is also a rapper in um, South Africa, SC rappers. So and he also knocks SC rappers out. This and they didn't respond. You, SA Rappers 2017, you didn't respond to LJ. I'm calling you out. If you post a day form, respond now. It's not too late. Three years down the line. Huh. Rapper, let me paint a portrait. How can you rule the game when you don't even get a line straight? Which rapper? How can you rule the game even even though you don't get a line straight? So if you can't rule a line, how can you rule the game? Can scare me, I don't even hear her name. Deaf and dumb rapper. Till the day rock nation sign me. Get the bar, now forget it, man. This one could make you starter. In bed, I'm a superman, I make a woman wonder. Chalk it now, make her break it down for all my Ghana people. Y'all be first year students. I'm taking rap to another level. Oh. Uh, uh, uh. In bed is a superman. He makes a woman wonder. <laughs> superman, like wonder, wonder woman. You get it? <laughs> and your first you're on the first like your fir, uh, first level like first year students like he's taking rap to another level when you're in level 100 you go to level 200 and you are still people you people, the other rappers are still first year students and he's taking rap to another level above niggas lj, LJ.
Oh, me, I'm a big fat Flow, never can I get past them Take an operator, if you know what's in my season I'll be ready for the delay, thank you for the dedication Slow, nobody to go past them Show, make another play, blast them Assassination with a meditation, repetition Leading to my recognition, vision, nigga, what you vision? Nice one Match yard, and that's the next Machiavelli Arresting your labels for abortion They bring you babies out to LA but uh, Arresting your labels for abortion They bring you babies out to LA Meaning that the labels are signing rappers that ain't good enough. They need to groom the rappers before they bring them out. I'm on Billy Gun, killer songs, hold me down, focus on getting on anything I'm gonna do with the group, only you follow my steps or your friend will lose. Oh Lord, and with them boys, we don't talk. Boy, I run up in your model, make her pussy cat walk. She says she <laughs> Boy, I run up in your model, make a pussy cat walk. When you're on the runway, the model ca cat walks on the uh, on the runway. But at the same time, he runs up in your model. Make a pussy cat walk. When he runs up in the model, the pussy cat walk. Man. The cat. The cat. A jamwa alonte. <laughs> the cat. <laughs> no. <laughs> Forgive me. Better figure me out. I'm like, no, girl, don't. They say misery loves company, baby. I'm a boss. Welcome to the high commission. Why call me Officer L? They say Satan is behind my boss. I'm releasing hell. Satan is behind my boss. They say I'm releasing hell. And he's like, he's too much fire. Like, the place is so hot. He's releasing fire. And Satan is behind. Of course, they say Satan is the ruler of hell. You get it. So if Satan is behind his bars, that's the reason for this heat. Put me don't cross on try at all. Make you no test, I get a paw. I'm a master. Even when I piss, it's a masterpiece. Make you no test, I get a paw. In Ghana, when they say a paw, that means you have like the cheats. You get it. Or you have like um, the answers to the test that's coming, the exam or whatever. So don't test him. He already has the, the answers. He already has the marking scheme. So he's already passed the thing. And even when he pieces is a masterpiece, now I don't want to talk about it because it's not really a deep line like that. Even I piss is a masterpiece. Yeah. When I piss, like piss, like you need, it's a masterpiece. Normal line, you bar. Hello world, let's have some silly conversation. President L, that's my time. I watch his politicking. My confession to all them ladies out. If money makes me marriage material, no bitch will get a yacht. Amen. Amen. <laughs> Let's take that line again. That line is deep. Let's take confession to all them ladies out. If money makes me marriage material, no bitch will get a yard. Amen. Amen. If money makes him marriage material, no bitch will get a yard. Meaning that if money is what will make him will make a girl marry him, then you're not going to get a like he's not going to do it. The same way is comparing it to when you take material, you get it. When you're measuring the material, me materials are cut in yards. You get it. One yard, two yards, blah, 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 blah. You get it. So if money makes a marriage material, then he's not going to cut a yard for any bitch. Sorry for referring to people as bitches, but that's what LJ said. Not me. <laughs> beast. 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 <laughs> Woo. Okay, so we're done. We're done. In case I missed some of the lines, I just decided not to like. Some of them are quite basic, so I decided not to touch on them. Like it's just straightforward. But those that are pregnant, I typed on them. I hope you like this. If you did like this, please hit the like button to represent the fact that you liked it, and subscribe and follow this page, man. Share this video to your friends so that they also understand some lines that they didn't understand in certain tracks and you can also go on and also suggest whatever um uh, what do you call it analysis you want us to do for you we got your back charlie it's rap it's the culture we're here for the co <laughs> and if they ask you <laughs> tell them 5.4k we out peace